Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing retirees in Thailand in the context of wills and estates. This is a subject that comes up rather frequently, and unfortunately, I do see folks that pass away here in Thailand, or I should say I see their estate after they've gone, and we have to deal with probate matters associated with those circumstances. And in those circumstances, it is an unfortunate situation if those individuals did not make prior arrangements prior to their passing to deal with their estate after they're gone. And it, it can really lead to some complexity and some problems, especially for relatives who they've left behind overseas. So if they've left their home country, they've retired in Thailand, and they, you know, they have property and they have no other heirs, their heirs in the United States may have really significant issues in executing uh, probate, and well, what, what we in the West would call probate, but basically dealing with the estate under the Thai legal system here and going ahead and getting a hold of that property and moving on with their own lives. So the reason I'm, I'm making this video is I think it's a good idea for those who are retired in Thailand who are concerned about their estate, it's a good idea to deal with it early and often. I, it's really nothing anybody wants to talk about. It's not something p folks really want to deal with. But getting a will done, it's just something, in my opinion, you just get it done and sort of forget about it and move on. And especially if you have close relatives that you want taken care of, it's a good idea to go ahead, get a will drafted, especially if you have property here in Thailand. It's a good idea to have a Thai will drafted to deal with that and get that situation sort of locked up, if you will, so that in the event you pass, you don't leave behind folks who are sort of, in a sense, kind of, for lack of a better term, left out in the cold. 